Hello, Sudoku friends, and welcome to yet another El Pais expert puzzle. This is our puzzle from the 5th of February 2024, and I will get started right away with the 6 4 pair here and the 6 4 pair here, forcing a 6 and a 4 to go here. Since we have a 4 blocking down this way, this must be a 6 and this must be a 4. These two 4s now force. Four to go here. We have a six blocking this way, and we have a six blocking this way. So here's a six. These two sixes block these squares. This six blocks this square. Here's a six. This six blocks down. These sixes block across, a six goes here. These two sixes block like so. And we have sixes blocking across like so. So the last six of this puzzle goes here. A couple of eights block across like this. So here's an eight. A nine must go here or here, blocking across, nine blocks down. Ah, I thought I had a nice nine here or here, but I don't. A seven, however, blocks down here and across here. So I know that one of these must be a seven, and this seven also blocks across, this seven blocks up. So one of these two must be a seven. And we are going to have a five either here or here, and therefore here or here. And that restricts the fives for column eight to this square. And this therefore must be a one. But I can do a little bit about the nines because we have these nines blocking five squares here and this nine blocks this square. So here's a nine. So let's get back to the nines. The nines can't go here. One of these is a nine, so a nine can't go here. We are going to have a nine in one of these two squares. An eight now, eight blocks down and across. We know that an eight goes here or here, blocking across. So we're going to have eight here or here. And uh, frankly, two, three, and eight block down here. So these squares must be two, three, and eight. I think this is a pattern that many solvers overlook, but it is extremely powerful. Two, three, eight, they can't go here. We have exactly three squares left here, and they absolutely have got to be a two, three, and an eight. While we can't place them yet, we now know that these three squares must be a four, five, and a seven. And that helps us because this four blocks across, this four blocks down, one of these is a four blocking up. This four blocks up, this four blocks across. One of these is a four, but look here. This four also blocks here. And this four blocks here. So this is a four. And therefore, this is a four. So let's go back to these squares. They have to be a four, five, and a seven. Remember? The five and a seven block here. So this is a four. 5 and 7 now here. A 7 blocks up, this 7 blocks up, and this 7 blocks across. So this is a 7. Look how much we get taken care of by noticing the 2, 3, and an 8 going in these squares. 7 blocks across here, 7 blocks across here, 7 must go here. 7 blocks down and across, here's a 7. So a seven and a five here. That means that these must be a one and a nine. I don't think I can do much with that. 
all we can say is that a 1 and a 9 must go in two of these squares here. We also need a 3 and an 8. So, I don't seem to be able to wrap my head around it at this time. But we can enter, yes, 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 we can enter a nine here because this nine blocks across. One of these is a nine blocking across. This nine blocks up. So here's a nine. And therefore, this is a one. And now this must be the nine, and these must be the three and the eight. And since that eight blocks here, this eight blocks here, this eight blocks across as well, and we know that one of these must be an 8 blocking across. This is where the 8 goes. Now, a uh, simple 2 and a 3 for these two squares. The 3, of course, forces a 2 to go here, while the 3 must go here. Uh, 1 and a 9 for these two positions, therefore, a 2 and a 3 for these. 2 and 3 for these two positions, and uh, 1 and 5 for these. Hmm. <laughs> That's interesting. But a little annoying. We'll get around to them, though. Meanwhile, we see this a 2 blocking down, and that means that this must be a 2. And this 2 now blocks across here. Therefore, one of these is a 2 blocking up. And we have this 2 blocking across. So we can enter a 2 here. And therefore, a 3 here. That gives us a 3 in the corner. And three squares to play with here, they must be a 1, 2, and a 5. Can't place any of those at the moment, but that means that these can't be 1, 2, and 5. They must be a 9 and an 8. The 8 blocks here, so here's a 9. Here's an 8. This now must be a 1. And these two must be a 9 and a 5. The 5 blocks over. Here's a 9. Here's a 5. We know that one of these had to be a 9. Now, we took away this candidate square for the 9. Therefore, the 9 must go here. 3 and 8 for these squares. And 3 and 8 here, not 3 and 8 here. I don't want to do a unique rectangle today. I'm convinced it is not going to be necessary. Our friends, the 5 and the 7 here, still not quite possible. Here we find ourselves in need of a 1 and a 2. All that tells me is that a 1 will have to go either here or here. We have a 3 and a 4 in these two squares, and it's easy to spot. And once you see it, you just can't unsee it. 3, 4 here, 3, 4 here, 3, 4 here. Look at this pattern. It absolutely means that 3 and 4 must go here and here. The 4 already blocks this square, which therefore must be a 3, and this must be a 4. We now have a 3 blocking up here, down here, and across here. That leaves only one square for a 3 in this row. That in turn gives me a 3 here and an 8 here. Two eights blocking across. Here's an 8. One of these had to be an 8, remember? Now the 8 blocks down, so here is the 8. 1, 2, 7 here. Still no joy. 1, 2, 7 here as well. But here we can do something, because the 7 blocks here, 
the seven blocks here. So here is in fact a seven. Now we know that this is a seven and this is finally the five we have been looking for for a while now. Here's also a five and a one and a two here. Two blocks over, here's a one, here's a two. Here's a one. And here is a two, which blocks this way. This two blocks this way, therefore a two goes here, and we are going to have a two here now. This corner square must be a one, giving me a one here and a five here. That leaves a five for this square and, of course, for this. Uh, one and a seven for these squares, the one blocks over, seven here, one here. Again, not too difficult, and I would submit that this is not an expert level puzzle. But, you know, easy puzzles are also quite fun to solve. Thank you for watching, and bye for now.